So we're gonna offer you a little video clip of um, proper leading positioning and technique that we hope will help volunteers as they um, return to volunteering or maybe need a refresh. So we're gonna go ahead and ask Cody to walk on. And if you'll note, the leader stays in a position between the horse's ear and shoulder. And she has a nice bit of a loose lead. She's using more of her body language to tell the horse what she needs and where she wants to go rather than using any pressure. We're going to do a halt transition at F. or between F and P is fine. So as she uh, starts to transition down, she'll tell him with her body language by walking a little bit slower. She'll ask with her voice. And then if she needed, she would follow up with the lead. But um, Cody responded really well just to her body language and her voice. All right, let's go ahead and ask Cody to walk on. Okay. And I like the way Betsy has her eyes, her chin up, her eyes forward. She's communicating with her horse where she wants to go with her eyes her and her shoulders and the speed at which she's walking. So if she were preparing for a trot transition, which we're going to do, Betsy, then she would start to pick up her walk a little bit that it's a signal to the horse that we're going to be transitioning to a faster gait and then she can go ahead and pick up that trot at between h and s and down to a walk excellent we're going to go ahead and do one more halt transition so you can see again at the letter p Excellent. Thank you.